Welcome to techivy.com, your solution providers. Uh, this is Abhishek and today we're gonna work on a layer tool called Liquify. And we're gonna do it by taking layers and we're gonna study the most one of the most important things in Photoshop that is using layers over a picture. What layer is is actually it's just a clear piece of acetate that we put on a picture so that we don't hurt or we don't change the actual pixels of the original image and just add effects at the top of a given image so we're gonna work on that and we're gonna work on the liquify tool so all right just open up a picture mm, I think Mm, maybe yeah okay so we have this picture from Emma Watson you know Hermione and as you can see this just unlock the layer first this is uh, this actually is a lock on the background that we need to unlock to get the layer that we want to work on this is just layer as you can see if I hide it, it just shows me the background. Like any other layer, just is one of the layer that we can work on. Mm. I think this would be okay. Okay. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to add a new layer at the top of it by clicking here. And then we're going to select. this layer and all right look if I paint it over with a brush by selecting this layer and hide it still shows me the original picture so the original picture is not lost and all my pixels remain secure as long as I work over a layer okay so Let's start working on it and let's go to yeah okay it looks good so let's go to filter and let's select liquify as you can see here and this tool we can load brushes if we want but the most important tool in this panel right here in the left is forward move tool which is actually a tool by which you can warp pictures uh, the pixels of a picture I mean <coughs> okay wait a second you can actually move the pixels around by this tool and you can fill any unevenness or like you can see the hair here it's actually gotten inward it's need to be straight like the spot on her head where the hair is not even if let me reduce the size first okay I think a little more oh, no, no, no. okay I can see I can actually move the pixels of the picture around and expand them as I like it I can fill in any gaps you can see it's important to do this in a one flow because if you don't it if you do it in parts it's gonna uh, go uneven I'm gonna fill in this gap of here by actually stretching the surrounding pixels towards it and it's important to do it in minimum number of counts so that you don't lose a lot of you know the pixels in it because it actually stretches the pixels and you lose some of the clarity of the image so it's important not to uh, maybe a little more I'm 
I'm gonna push this here outside. You can do it too if you like. Now that's a better selection than the previous one as you can see. The clarity is not lost and still, still we get the image that we wanted to give. Okay. Nice. That looks pretty good. And apart. Let me push that. I'll just push that in a little more. That actually looked pretty bad. But as you can see now, it looks original and we haven't stretched the pixels a lot, so it looks original as you can see in both these sides. Yeah, that's a pretty picture now. So, what we did was we took the surrounding pixels to put uh, more of the pixels outward or inward as we wanted it and we actually stretch the pixels like we can do it here too you can reduce this bump uh, you can actually stretch uh, what we should do is actually we should do it reverse of it we should actually pump it down like this yeah You should just find a distinct line when it uh, looks original and that should be it. Look much better than previous one. Maybe a little bit more here. Okay. Here it goes. Okay. Yeah. That looks good and so this is our final image let's click OK and OK so as you can see here what we did was we stretched the pixels around in order to fill in the gaps and any awkward situations that we had over the hill you can do it with any other thing like skin like bumps or eyes eyebrows you can stretch them that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.